Good morning and welcome to FIT Sustainability Awareness Week. If sustainability is something that you care about, FIT is the place to be. For us, it is a way of life. We believe that the preservation of our planet's environment and resources is one of the most urgent issues of our time, and we take it personally and have been consciously working at it for really as long as I can remember. And if you look at the program we have devised for this week, you will get a sense of the breadth of our community. You'll find everything from biodiversity to our beehive project, to the development of sustainable materials by FIT scientists and students. We are very pleased that activist and actress Amber Valletta has joined us for one of the material science presentations. And you will have an opportunity to tour our green rooms, virtually of course, and learn how FIT faculty and students connected to a community of women textile artisans in West Africa. And at the end of the week, you'll have an opportunity to learn how to turn that old pair of jeans you were about to discard into a beautiful crossbody bag. So this just touches the surface of our week of activities, but it tells you something about our commitment to sustainability. I'm proud to say that FIT has been acknowledged many times over for our accomplishments. As long ago as 2001, we started reducing our carbon footprint, and today we have achieved a 55% reduction. And we did it in record time. And on a terrace not far from my office, students developed and have nurtured a natural dye garden to produce non-toxic fabric dots for use in our campus textile research. Speaking of research, our faculty and students are engaged in numerous research projects, some strikingly innovative, such as making sustainable materials out of seaweed or shoes from organic matter, such as cellulose and pineapples. We're partnering with research giants, such as MIT, Stony Brook, and Drexel, in similar projects. Our photography students are learning how to probe the oceans from an award-winning environmental photographer on our faculty, and other students have joined a marine biologist in our science department on expeditions to protect marine mammal life. Our campus recycling and water refill stations are annual events such as our Sustainable Business and Design Conference, which is now in its 14th year, and our popular minor in ethics and sustainability are among the many initiatives that have earned us this recognition. So when I hear about heat waves in the Antarctic, or I think about the way fires are devouring so much of the West, I am truly gratified that we have been turning out graduates who are passionate about sustainability and have been exposed to or participated in our efforts on campus. They are the rising generation of designers and industry leaders who will help to shape our planet's future. So I think of them with great hope. But for now, I hope that all of you will enjoy and benefit from this week's rich agenda of activities and presentations all about sustainability. 